Hey fellow backyard boyers, Nick here. Now today I'm going to be forging a rebar tent stake with an extra large welded loop on this one. See it's just big enough to get your hand in so that you can hold on to your stakes better and also assist when driving your stakes into the ground. And this is welded for strength so this doesn't pull out and things can't get underneath or come out of the loop here. The design of this stake was inspired by the last build we did. And as you can see, it's a really sturdy stake. The rebar texture here helps keep it in the ground. And so this is good for staking down tents, tarps, and anything that you need to tie in place. Let's get started. To make this stake, I'm starting off with a piece of 3 8 inch rebar. The first thing I'm going to do is bevel the edge here and grind it to an almost point to prepare for welding. Let's fire up the forge. Like the last build, I'm going to be starting off with a 90 degree angle at the end of my bar. So I'm going to start folding over the handle at about four and a half inches. I'm just going to straighten everything out and clean this up. So I've gone ahead and cut this portion down to six and a half inches. Now I'm going to take this to my MIG welder and just weld this section together to give this loop more strength and also to prevent things from sliding underneath this in either direction. So here it is after welding. The weld's pretty solid. It looks a little ugly, so I'm gonna grind these outer edges off, just smooth them down a little bit, and I'm gonna sand them, and then we can forge in the point. Heated everything up. I'm just going to clean it off. And this is just so that right here in the weld, everything can sort of normalize. There aren't any brittle spots. And I also want to do this a couple more times because while you should use a mallet with a stake like this, if you do use a hammer, it won't damage the stake. I'm going to quench this. Just let it come back. Want to let the temper just kind of go back down toward the point. So here's the stake. When I'm driving these into the ground, I like to get a good grip and get them to go at an angle so I can attach to this portion and it's harder to pull out because it's at a bit of an angle here. Mm. 
I hope you enjoyed forging this along with me today. If you have any suggestions for other things you'd like to see me make, please let me know in the comments below. If you like what I'm doing, be sure to check out my channel for other videos like this, and I've also written several books on different topics, and I'll put links to those in the description below. And before I go, I'd like to give a huge thanks to everyone who's supporting me on Patreon. It's because of you that I'm able to continue doing videos like this. If you'd like to join the Patreon family and support the channel directly, I'll put a link to the Patreon page in the description below. So as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!